Hi everybody, this is Dixie. Um, today's video is just going to be going over the first five clean eating commandments. Now we do have ten of them, but we're going to cut it in half and just go over the first five. So our first commandment is for you to eat more. We want you guys to eat six, um, five to six small meals throughout the day and we want to make sure that they're spread out in between two and a half to three hour intervals. And this is going to do two different things for you. Is it's going to help fuel your body throughout the entire day. It's going to help keep your metabolism running throughout the whole day, which in course helps with fat burning. But also it's going to help us with our portion control eating. We're going to start eating smaller amounts more frequently so that you can train your body on how much food that you really need to be eating um, versus the what we're used to, which is engorging ourselves in overeating. Now our second commandment is eat breakfast. It's very important that you guys eat breakfast every single day, but not only eat it, but make sure that you guys get it in within an hour of waking. Breakfast is your most crucial meal of the day, so we wanna make sure that you guys are getting it in as soon as possible. Um, what this is gonna do is it's gonna start that fat burning process. It's gonna start your metabolism and it's gonna set you up for success for the rest of the day. Make sure it's a clean meal. If you guys end up drinking, if you do coffee and a donut, your body is gonna naturally crave those sugars throughout the entire day. But if you do something a little bit more clean, like some eggs and spinach, um, that's really gonna help your body to where it's gonna crave those healthy things. So make sure that you guys choose wisely when you're doing your breakfast. Commandment number three is to avoid um, white sugar, artificial sweeteners, and alcohol. Those three things are gonna slow down your results drastically. So during this 30 day challenge, I really want you guys to avoid it as much as possible. Try to incorporate it into a daily lifestyle. But if you wanna see those results come on quickly, get those three things out of your diet because those are gonna slow it down. They act as a toxin in the body. And when your body's fighting off toxins, then it, you're not gonna be able to lose weight as quickly. Now, at clean eating commandment number four, we want you guys to eat a combination of lean protein and complex carbs. The reason for this is with them paired together, they're gonna actually work synergistically in order to help your body. Complex carbs is our form of energy, but if you eat that with a lean protein, it's gonna help your body process it a lot quicker to where you can use that energy and the carbs are not stored in the system as any type of fat. So some options that you can do. So for breakfast, you could do like a Greek yogurt with some granola. You can do wheat toast with some peanut butter on it. You can do grilled chicken and brown rice. Um, I will supply you guys with a bunch of different options. I'll give you a list where you could choose one from each and pair them together. So make sure that you use that list as a guide to help you in choosing on how to pair those two items. And then our fifth one is eating a healthy fat each day. Make sure you have a sufficient amount of healthy fats in your diet. And where this comes from is like your avocados, your polyunsaturated oils. Um, the oils are mainly gonna be things that we're using like on our salads. So I will give you guys a guide for the difference of your polyunsaturated and your monounsaturated oils. That way if you're making your own dressings, you can make sure that you're choosing from the healthy fats list. Um, but there's many ways that you guys can get your healthy fats and I will also supply you with the list. So if you want, you can print those lists out and just kind of have them as a guide or keep them handy on your phone or on your computer. So those are the first five commandments. Make sure that you guys really try to follow through with them. This entire sheet should already be printed. And if it's printed, I want you guys to make sure that it's on your fridge so that you see it every time you are going to get something to eat. It's gonna help you make wiser choices, especially if you're getting in the fridge and you're really not hungry, you're just in the habit of trying to look for what's to snack. So follow those through. If you guys have any questions on it, you need any tips on those first five commandments, um, just comment below this video and we'd be, we would love to help you guys out. Have a great day.